Hey, what's up? It's Ben here. Do you have an exit strategy when you hit retirement age? Like, do you think Social Security will be around for you when you retire? Do you think you can still be working or doing the heavy lifting at the age of 60 or 70 years old? If you answer no to any of these, you might need to have a plan in place when you get old to supplement your income like a retirement account. Today, I'm specifically talking about a Roth IRA on Weibo, and of course you could do it elsewhere because whatever you put in and after the age of 59 and a half years old, you can withdraw any of your gains from your investment tax-free. Yes, literally it could be a million dollars without having to pay taxes on it. You can easily build a portfolio like that, but it'll just take a lot of time, which I'm trying to do because there's a limit of how much you can put in to your Roth IRA each year. As of now for 2020, the limit is currently at $6,000. Now I'm not a tax accountant. This is just what I do to show you what's possible. But first things first, if you haven't done so, you need to open an Weibo account first. If you need the instructions on how to do so, feel free to check out my step-by-step -step video on that. And don't forget to collect your two free stocks when you open an account. Links are in the description if you don't wanna leave free money on the table. So let's go straight into the desktop and see how easy it is to open and deposit money to a Roth IRA on Weibo. This account is for my brother since I already have one set up on Weibo, so let's go. So first things first, you need to sign into your account and if your account is new, you'll see something like this. What you want to do is scroll down and click open an IRA. Then go ahead and confirm your personal information. This is basically just the information that you put in to sign up for the account. It's just the same. Just go ahead and scroll down and confirm and then click next. And then, so this is the account type. So there's traditional IRA, Roth IRA, and rollover IRA. So these are the basic information of them. But what you wanna do is click on Roth IRA and then scroll down and then click next. Then what you wanna do is read the terms and condition and then click the e-signature to sign. Click save and then click I agree. And voila, you just completed the application for Roth IRA. It'll take one to two days for approval, but once it's approved, then you go on to funding your account and I'll show you next. So once again, you'll be greeted by the screen. What you wanna do is scroll down and click on view details on Roth IRA. Then you hit deposit. Then what you wanna do is go to your account and click on Roth IRA because you don't wanna use it on the individual account. So for this step, you're gonna use real-time verification because it's the fastest way to transfer your money into the account. So we're gonna use Bank of America, type in your information, your bank information, and then proceed to the next step. Then a pop-up will appear talking about the ACH transactions. So once you're done reading that, you just click got it. So my brother is going to put in 2,500 for this type of account. And then for the contribution type, it's going to be regular contribution year will be 2019 since he still has time to put in for 2019 year. So once that's all done, you're going to scroll down and click contribute. So then it'll take you to this screen for a final verification of the transaction. Once you agree to that, you hit confirm and you're done. Basically, you're gonna have to wait about within five business days for the funds to get in, and once that's in, you can trade. And here's a quick chart to see how much you can contribute and whether or not you qualify. And there you have it. If you're able to maximize your contributions every year and reinvest the gains back into the index fund that averages around 7% a year, in 37 years or so, you can retire as a tax-free millionaire. I'm just saying numbers and data don't lie. It's better to start now than later. So if you found this to be helpful, feel free to give it a like and maybe consider subscribing as I actually show you what I invest inside my Roth IRA with my own money. I'll catch y'all later.